Hey, I'm Washington DC lawyer Frank Carney and I'm here to talk to you about what you need to do if you need surgery because of an injury that happened at work. So you're in the workers comp system and your doctor says you need surgery, how do you get that? Well, the insurance company's got to authorize that, first of all. Uh, what do they do to prevent you from getting surgery and to fight that? Well, a lot of times they'll send you to one of their doctors, an insurance doctor, sometimes what they call an IME. You got to really research that doctor and, and understand that doctor's background, okay? Because a lot of these IME insurance physicians, they don't even do the procedures that your doctor wants to, wants to perform, okay? So if you've got a severe knee injury, for example, you need a knee replacement, a lot of times the insurance company will send you to a doctor who hasn't done a knee replacement in 20 years, all right? So in my view, that's a biased or invalid evaluation. That's one of the things the insurance companies do. So you really have to understand who the players are in this system. That's one thing. Um, the other thing they'll do is what we call utilization review. What's utilization review? It's a total scam. That's what it is. What it is, is it's a um, review of your records by some doctor in Texas or Louisiana or California who's never seen you, may not even have the same expertise or specialty that your physician has, your treating doctor has, and that doctor goes through your medical records and writes up a report. He doesn't really write it because it's all done by the insurance company and in the end says you don't need this surgery, that it's not reasonable or necessary. We see these same reports over and over. The problem in DC is by law, the judges have to consider these reports. So you really have to have a good game plan for how you're gonna attack that report, how you're gonna use it with your doctor. And that's one of the keys is working with your doctor and any medical consultants um, that you have access to as well. That's a lot of what we do when our clients need surgery. Here's another tip. If the insurance company denies the surgery and you have private health insurance, you can use your health insurance for it because it's been denied. There is no primary insurance. Um, so if your health insurance puts up a fight on that, make sure you, you continue to go after them as far as that goes, because the reality is if you need litigation over this, over whether you need a surgery and whether it's going to be authorized, that can sometimes take you six or nine months. You need the surgery most likely right away. So you want to do everything you can to one, get the medical treatment that you need so you can feel better and you can get on your way um, to rehab that injury and that condition. Two, put your case in the best, in the best um, position possible uh, so that you can win it, so that you can get everything you're entitled to, including all that future medical care that you, that you may need for your injury, all right? We help a lot of people stand up to the insurance company after a serious injury, um, when they have an on-the-job injury and they're in the workers' comp system. So please give us a call, 202-393-3320, if you need this help, and we'll help to take care of you. Thank you.